reasons why you shouldn't be a nurse. One, you only want to be a nurse because you saw some cute scrubs on Instagram. Nothing is not for you. Because ain't a goddamn thing cute about waking up and eating trauma for breakfast at 7 o'clock in the morning. We just make that shit look good. Also, this is nothing like Grey's Anatomy. Two, we ain't in it just for the money, honey. But I'm definitely in it for the honeys with the money. <laughs> Three, if you don't know how to talk to people, sit this one out. Because this, what you see on this stage, is walking, talking therapy. Communication is the rope that either pulls someone out of a dark place or puts them in a dark place forever. The difference between life and death is literally one misplaced word. So if you don't know how to speak life, then shut the whole fuck up and go play with somebody else's career, respectfully. Four, labor and delivery is not all sunshine and rainbows. It's not just the first whiff of newborns and tightly swaddled infants. L&D is the OR that smells like the pennies in your grandfather's crown royal bag. Room permeated with the scent of iron, painted scarlet red with blood because your patient has just had a postpartum hemorrhage from her emergency C-section. It's also the butterflies we use to signify to all the passersby that this mother's child has died. Are you sure you can stomach that? Five, Becky's carries and Susan's need not apply. Not saying if your name is Becky, Karen, or Susan that you shouldn't apply, but if you got the potential to go viral for ignorant, self-centered, and racist viewpoints, then check your white privilege at the door, then go talk to your primary care provider about if being a nurse is really right for you. Six, if you don't think COVID is real, this is not for you. Seven, if you got a weak stomach or thin skin, this is not for you. One or the other gotta be strong. Eight, if you don't drink alcohol or espresso, this is not for you. Nurses call the shots, but we also take them. Nine, if you ever once in your life said they're just nurses, this is definitely not for you. 10, if you're not a team player, I'm gonna need you to go and pick another extreme sport because the squad you have will literally make or break your day around here. Nursing friends are better than regular friends and I dare you to try and change my mind. Because once you've been side by side, deep in the trenches through blood, sweat, shit, piss, and tears, riding with complete strangers on their highest and their lowest moments in their lives together as a team, that makes you something more than just a coworker. You become family. So if none of these reasons have scared you, and if, you, and if I haven't dissuaded you from being a nurse by the end of this poem, then congratulations. This actually might be for you. And you're more than welcome to come join our family.